Hi guys, so in this tutorial we will be discussing how to insert a new node in the middle of singly linked list. So let's get started. So here we have a linker list with four nodes and uh, we have to add new node in the middle of this list. Uh, for that uh, we will be using Floyd algorithm to find the middle of the uh, linker list where we will be adding a new node. So as per the Floyd alg algorithm we will be using two pointer approach here. The first pointer will be slow pointer which will be moving one step at a time and another pointer will be fast pointer which will be moving two step at a time. So let's move this pointer uh, first pointer. So you can see this is a fast pointer which will be moving two step at a time from here to one step and two step and now uh, will be moving this slow pointer uh, one step at a time. So let's move this as well. So this is the first iteration. Now in the second second iteration it will again check whether this first dot next dot next. If it is not null then only it will be moving the same uh, uh, step again for slow and fast. So let's check whether first dot next dot next is null or not. So fast dot next fast here fast is point fast is pointing to a node which has data 30. So we have to check fast next dot next. So fast dot next dot next. So fast next dot next is pointing to null. It means we will be we will not be moving uh, fast pointer um, and slow pointer. So it will be pointing to here means. Uh, now we know we have to add a new node in the middle of slow and fast pointer that is 20 and 30 in between of these nodes we will be adding new node. So let's uh, do that yeah we have added this new node with data 50 and the reference of uh, newly created node is pointing to null by default. Now so our uh, first job is the newly created reference should be pointing to uh, slow dot next means slow is this and the next of slow is this one. So the newly created node should also point to uh, slow dot next node. So that will be taking care of this uh, line of code new dot next is equal to slow dot get next. So slow dot get next means this one is slow dot get next. <coughs> Now another job is now our slow should start pointing to newly created node here. So to do that we will be <coughs> see slow dot next is equal to node. So we are this line is saying uh, slow should start pointing to newly created node. Slow dot next should start pointing to this node newly created node. Now the previous uh, reference of uh, slow node is no longer available you can see here now um, this newly created node is added in the middle of this uh, list now you can see here this is the newly created node and it got added in the middle of this list so earlier we had four nodes 10 20 30 and 40 now we have added the new node in the middle of uh, linker list now you can see we have uh, we have 50 here in between of uh, in between of 20 and 30 that is a middle of uh, linker list now this is the graphical representation of inserting node in the middle of uh, sing singly linked list now let's get started with backend code so for that i have created one uh, class insert node at middle so here we'll be developing method which will be taking care of inserting node in the middle of singly linked list. So let's get started. Private void and method name will be insert at mid which will be uh, expecting an input parameter as data of uh, in type. <coughs> Now uh, 
we will be creating a new node as we discussed node is equal to new node so the data of that newly created node will be will be receiving from this uh, insert at mid method variable now we need to check whether this head is pointing to null or, or not so let's create head first private node head now let's check whether this head is pointing to null or not objects dot uh, we should be checking null if it is null so the in the new node which we are trying to insert you in the middle will get added in the first node of the linker list so here we have uh, head is equal to node that is a basically newly created node but if it is not null means there are nodes available so we have to uh, use here Floyd uh, algorithm as per that uh, let's discuss this let's say if we have nodes as 10 20 30 and 40 and uh, 40 references pointing to null now I'll be using here one slow which will be pointing to this and another one will be fast pointer so initially both of the uh, these pointer will pointing to uh, first node of uh, singly linked list now let's go here let's create these two pointers node and uh, slow comma fast so initially both of the pointer will point to uh, head now uh, we need to iterate this whether uh, slow and fast is null or not object start non null uh, fast dot get next and uh, objects dot non null fast dot get next dot get next so before moving steps uh, steps of slow and fast we will be checking these conditions if these conditions are true then only we will be moving our pointer uh, slow pointer uh, one step and fast pointer two step now uh, if this condition is true so we will be moving the slow pointer one step and fast pointer two step at a time here so let's do that slow is equal to slow dot get next now fast pointer should move two step at a time fast dot get next dot get next now on each iteration it will be checking whether uh, this condition is true or not when this condition is true then only we will be uh, moving these pointers so now <coughs> uh, one iteration is done now let's check for the second iteration so here we are checking whether fast dot get next is null or not so it is not null here you can checking because uh, fast dot next we have 40 now we are checking another condition fast dot get next dot get next means fast is pointing to node which has data 30 so the get next of fast is 40 and again get next of uh, 40 is null means it's point uh, two step of uh, fast pointer is pointing to null here so this condition will not true so will this will exit from this while loop now <coughs> we are at now we found that we have to add newly created node in the middle of uh, fast and 
and slow pointer means wherever the fast and slow pointer is pointing so slow pointer is pointing to node which has data 20 and fast pointer is pointing to node which has data 30 so in between of uh, these nodes we have to add new node so now let's do that uh, so first step is I'll tell you now first step is we have to connect we have created this uh, new node um, now first step is we have to uh, now this reference of newly created node should point to uh, wherever slow dot next is pointing okay from here to here the so slow dot next is currently pointing to this node so this newly created uh, node reference should also point to the same node let's do that uh, node dot set next should point wherever slow dot get next is pointing this is the first step the second step is now uh, slow dot next should start pointing to node new node so slow dot set next should start pointing to newly created node now you can see in yeah, here uh, pictorial view so this is line which will be taking care of uh, connecting these slow dot next with uh, uh, wherever sorry uh, newly created node next is pointing to wherever uh, this slow dot next is pointing now another step is slow should start pointing to wherever head is there so you can see here slow dot next is pointing to newly created node here now uh, we have added this new node in the between of uh, singly linked list now the next job is we need to uh, write main method to verify whether this is working fine or not man and uh, <coughs> let's create the object of current class so that we will be able to access the uh, data member of this class so list is equal to new insert node at middle list dot insert at middle so we'll be adding first here and we have created one class with name display list or print list print yeah print linker list which has display method which will be taking care of uh, printing all the nodes of the linker list now let's run the uh, this and verify whether we are getting 10 or not even there are no nodes available so it should get added as a first node of singly linked list yeah you can see here it's f it got added as a first node so let's insert it again let's perform the same operation operation again now there is only one node so this newly uh, added node should add next to uh, this first node which has data 10 yeah you can see here uh, we had uh, the first node which we have we had added 10 and the second node we had uh, we have added 20 so 20 is 20 got added with the next of uh, 10 now let's perform the same operation again now we have two nodes so this node uh, which has data 30 should get added in the in between of 10 and 20 because we are performing the uh, insert at mid operation so if there is there are two nodes available then only it will get added in the middle of those nodes otherwise it will get added if there is only one node so it will get added next to that node if there are no nodes available so the newly added node will get add in the uh, uh, first node now you can see this 30 is uh, inserted in the middle of this list let's perform a operation again and this is 40 
this is fit 50 now output should be 10 20 30 sorry a 10 it should be a 10 20 it should be 30 here 30 and then 10 30 20 then it should be 40 and then it should be 50 now let's run this now yeah so let's verify this output with the output which uh, we have discussed now you can check uh, first is 10 and then second is 30 and then 50 is in between of uh, these nodes means in the middle of these nodes so uh, this is the 50 which we had we have added in the last so it got added in the middle of this list you can see here we have two nodes this side and two nodes this side so 50 got added in the middle of singly linked list so that's it from this video guys and uh, thank you so much for watching this video stay tuned for another videos thank you